All right. Well, hey, welcome everybody to another Wisdom Weekly. It is Friday, June 4th, and um, our regular time here, noon Eastern, 9 a.m. And I'm really excited this morning to get to hear an interview with Jamie Summers, which we'll get to that in just a minute. But um, real quick, worthy of recognition is several of you and members of your team that have already stepped up or took a step in May. We were just talking, I was just chatting with Bill uh, Pierce here before the call started and they are one of them, but we'll get to that. So um, thank you, Marjorie, for sending this to me um, here when the month is barely just kind of closed out of May. And uh, I don't, by the way, speaking of that, I'm not sure why, but the website is in the process of doing its little conversion from May to June, it looks like, because everything's zeroed out. I can't see May and June's not available yet. So I can't can't recognize the uh, top 20, the final top 20 of the 90 days of spring that ended a few couple few days ago, three days ago, I guess it was. Can't recognize that yet. We'll do that next week. Um, can't even recognize the monthly top 20 of May because I can't see that in my website either right now at the moment. I'm sure it'll come up any minute. But anyway, I can recognize all the step ups from May and we have a few. So without further ado, new managers in the month of May here in the Wisdom Builders team, Terry Kinsey, congratulations to you. Um, that's under Jody and Elizabeth Martin. So one of their new managers, which is in the Lee and Susan Adams world team. Um, also new manager, Sarah Kaltner. I hope I'm saying that right, Sarah Kaltner. Um, and their sponsors, Chad and Janice, or her sponsors, Chad and Janice Johnson, new manager in the month of May. Chris Dyer, new manager also in the month of May. Um, Nicole and myself, I, I guess, not a guess, I know Nicole gets credit for that, um, helping Chris get started and make manager right away in May. Congratulations to you, Chris. Um, new senior managers in the month of May, Carolyn or Caroline. Reyes, congratulations, Caroline, or Carolyn. I'm not sure. Sorry if I'm saying it wrong. I'll say it both ways. I know one of them's got to be right. Um, under Ann Irene Chamberlain, which is in Gary and Shelley Lazone's team. And another new senior manager in the month of May was Anna Pfeiffer. Congratulations, Anna. Um, also uh, sponsored by Chad and Janice Johnson. Janice is on fire. Um, let's see, that was Anna Pfeiffer. And then getting to the Emerald managers for the month of May, brand new, shiny, squeaky, clean, brand spanky new, Jeff and Sabrina Boozer under Bobby McGraw, which is in Josh and Chelsea's team. Congratulations to the Boozers, great friends of ours, awesome couple. And as I was just mentioning earlier, last but not least, new Emerald director as well, Bill and Sarah Pierce. Congratulations and well-earned, well-deserved. And uh, it's exciting to see each and every one of you inspiring so many people along the way. It's so fun to know somewhere along the line, each one of us tipped a domino, so to speak, that affected somebody's life, that affected somebody's life. And and now we see, you know, the, the results of that, the fruit of that, of people's health transforming and wealth transforming, all because we care and share it. And it's so, so rewarding and so fun. It gets me excited just thinking about it. So with that, I am going to turn it over to Josh, who is on a plane. This is pretty cool. Josh is going to do this interview while he's flying midair on his way to Costa Rica with his family right now, literally, as we speak, uh, for the mission trip. And um, one of us is on the way there too, our son Braden, but the rest of us couldn't make it this year. But anyway, he actually pre-recorded this interview with Jamie Summers before he left. So I am get the, the easy job of hitting play and sharing my screen. So without further ado, I am going to do that for you right now. And I have not seen this yet, but I'm super excited about it. So let's see, it would be that one there. And, oh, you know what? Okay, little trick. When you share screen, the little check, you check the bottom left corner, it says share sound and the sound will be better. Okay, now I'm gonna share it. There we go. 
Now, who can I see? Marjorie, can you give me a thumbs up if you can see the black screen, the Zoom, where my cursor is moving around? Good, thank you. Okay, here we go. I think we're gonna go. We're trying to go. Uh, network error, hold on. Try it again. Pause, play, huh, refresh, and play. All right, so I'm really excited to have the opportunity Audrey. to Good. interview Jamie Summers, who is a new Neolive promoter, relatively new, with the Wisdom Builder team under Alan and Nicole Blaine. And she's actually an executive manager on her way to quickly to director. And uh, I asked her if she would just jump on since so she couldn't make the Wisdom Weekly due to schedule, if she would just share a little bit of her story with us. So Jamie, thank you for joining me today. Thank you for having me. Super excited. Well, it's my privilege. And uh, will you just um, share with the, uh, with the, fam with the family? The Wisdom Builder family here um, uh, over uh, our Wisdom Weekly, where they'll get to hear your story. Will you just share with us, kind of take us from the beginning? Um, but I think begin with just introducing yourself, your background, where you're you're from, and, yeah, for and sure. so forth. Yeah, so uh, for those of you that I have not had the honor to meet yet, uh, my name is Jamie Summers. Uh, I live in Cedar Lake, Indiana. I'm married to my high school sweetheart, Matt. Uh, we have two incredible kids. Oh, there they are my heart. Um, Kirsten and Talon, a uh, little side note, I had both of them when I was 23 and they're not twins, which is crazy, right? They're Irish twins. They're 11 and a half months apart. Um, I have my bachelor's in health and wellness. I have been in the fitness industry for a little over 10 years. Um, I absolutely love what I get to do. And my family is a big driving force that directed me into that passion of health and wellness. Um, so I'm very grateful for for that. Yeah. So that's a little bit about me in a nutshell. Um, where yeah. I'm from everything. So you're a trainer? Yes. Neat. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> it's yeah. so much fun. How long have you been doing that? A little over 10 years. I started as a group fitness instructor um, and it's old school step aerobics. <laughs> so much fun. And I see your, your whole family is, is, in, is into fitness as well. And yeah, big athletic family, um, which is good. So yeah, um, it's nice to have that passion alongside my husband and be able to do that together. Um, he is a union electrician, uh, project manager. Uh, so it's nice that we have that common ground in uh, fitness together, uh, working towards being the healthiest parents that our two kids deserve. So yeah, it's, it's a lot of fun. And um, it's nice to see the kids pick up on those good habits too. And then their kids still, you know, so it's, it's good. And uh, so share with us, how did you find Neolife? Oh, and this is a, a really cool story. Yeah. So um, let me uh, let me take you on back, right? Yeah. So when my youngest talent was in preschool, um, and he is 14 now. So when he was in preschool, we decided to go to the YMCA for that. And instead of me driving home, I decided to jump into fitness classes. And I got really inspired by the instructors at that point in my life. Um, and funny story was I was actually going to school to be a elementary school teacher. I had 10 classes left and then I was going to be done, like graduated and everything. And I'm like, you know what? It'd be really fun to like be a group fitness instructor, finishing up my education. Um, so I did just that. And I got really passionate about health and it was so much fun, you know, just coaching all the ladies and I found myself diving deep into like better health and, and learning about that at the same point of getting super frustrated because it didn't matter how much I was working out or teaching my classes or eating healthy. Um, I couldn't reach the results that I thought that my efforts should have gotten, you know? So I decided that I needed to wake up one day and tell myself, I need to stop saying I'm doing everything right. Like, I need to figure out what I'm doing wrong. Um, and I called my counselor. I'm like, I know I want to be a teacher, but in like a different arena. Um, so I decided to switch degrees and I got my bachelor's in health and wellness. 
I learned what it meant to be nutrient sufficient. And I was on a hunt for a better vitamin that would absorb on a cellular level. And at that point in my life, I didn't even know Neo Life existed, right? I uh, paired with a company um, that I was a part of and became a uh, part of them for seven years. They've been around for, geez, over 20 some years, 26 years at that point, um, and fell in love with what I got to do. Um, it impacted my life um, as far as uh, our better health and then moving towards helping other people. Um, but there was a day that came uh, with this company that they pulled the rug out from underneath their leadership. And, you know, they, it was hard to go through. It really was, um, you know, I'm, I'm sure you're familiar with uh, Advocare, right? So I was a part of that company for seven years. And I'm a big believer for being in life, like everything in life happens not to us, but for us. Yes. Right. And I'm very grateful for that season of my life because mm -hmm. it created a lot of personal growth for myself. Um, so from that transition of them pulling out the direct sales opportunity into a single model, um, our leadership moved to a different company. Still didn't hear, I still didn't hear of Neo Life yet. Right. So, you know, I'm very much was. Right, I'm science driven. I'm going to look at ingredients. That's where I agree with ingredients. And then I jump, right? So when you look at that, um, when I became a part of that company, I just like, it was like a square peg in a circle hole. Like I didn't really fit as far as my passion and I'm very much side med board and, and things like that. And I didn't feel the greatest, right? I was dealing with a lot of brain fog. And I had to remind myself, even though for seven years of, you know, being a part of a leadership team and, and growing through that together, there was a day that was my day one. And my day one was me putting my yes first for being the healthiest version that my kids deserve. And I had to remind myself that's how it all started. Yeah. So I had to take a quick look at myself and say, you know what, I need to figure out what's best for me, what's next. And I put my science hat on and I went and I went on the internet webs and I'm like, healthy, clean, like nutrition, vitamins. Like I, it took me a while to find you guys. <laughs> and then once I finally did, and I knew I wanted to be a part of a direct sales company because yeah. I just, I love the leadership behind it. I love being able to make an impact bigger than, uh, you know, being able to just suggest someone to go to you know, your local vitamin store or whatever, you know, I just, I knew what I could have the opportunity to do. And if I could find the right company with the right products, um, with the right opportunity, I knew that my heartbeat would be where that belongs. Um, so I found you guys and I was blown away at everything I've seen. I'm like, how has this company been around for like over 60 years? And nobody told me about it. Like, I cannot right. believe that I didn't know about you guys. So then I go on Facebook. And I'm like, Neo Life. And I went to uh, your Facebook page and you guys recently had a incentive trip that you posted a bunch of amazing photos. And I see the people that you tag. And I'm like, okay, if I'm going to be a part of something here, I need to be a part of a leadership team that walks the walk that they talk. And there I click on Alan and Nicole Blaine. I went to their Facebook page and like Facebook sucked them for a second. And I'm like, you know what? Like, these are people that I feel walk the walk that they talk. And I, I was very um, impressed with how they held themselves on social media. And I decided to send them a private Facebook message. And yeah, they reached out and were just incredible with answering all my questions and uh, leading me towards making the best decision for our family. Wow. Long-winded story, but like that, that's how I found wow. you guys. Well, I'm so sorry that, um, of course, you had to go through that with Avacare. I remember um, has the morning after all that happened, it just blew me away. And I, it just broke my heart for the distributors, what they went through. But as you know, and as I, as I share with you, and when we talked early on, you don't have to worry about that here. This company is um, built by, and Jer the, the Brassfields always say that this company is they're stewarding this for 
the promoters who own the company, who built the company. So uh, you are definitely home, but um, I'm sorry to go through all that to find to find home, but uh, yeah. you're here. So um, share with us how have the, you know, I really respect how you did your homework. You know, I even respect how you followed your team to that other company um, out of, you know, loyalty as well. Like, you know, you enjoyed the team you had, you followed your upline to that. And then you real, as you said, you weren't, you weren't getting the results that you needed, you know, the brain fog, you said, and the low energy and different, right? Yep. And so what is, and then, uh, you know, you, you did some, you did some research for a while, even after talking to Alan and Nicole. Yes. Yes. And uh, so it's not anything you've rushed into. That is for sure. <laughs> um, in fact, we're having this conversation, um, uh, let's see, about a year later since I, yeah. since I first met you yep. and when Alan and Nicole did it, introduced me. So um, share with, if you'll share with everyone, how has the Neolife products impacted your health and your family's health so far? What have you noticed? What do you, what yeah. do you know about? So for me, I am such a foundational girl. So when I'm looking at a company, I'm looking at how can they help me become nutrient sufficient? So mm -hmm. for me, it has to start at just like if you're building a house, right? If you don't get the foundation right, it doesn't matter what you do, what you put on top of it. It's never just going to settle right. Um, so for me, I needed to find a good vitamin, a good mineral, um, you know, knowing that they've changed the way that they grow our food nowadays, like since the fifties, it doesn't matter how healthy we eat nowadays. We're always going to fall short. So we have to um, have a great supplementation that's going to go in on a cellular level and do what it's supposed to do to fill in those nutritional gaps. Right. So I needed to find that. So for me, pro vitality is like non-negotiable everyday based product for me. You know, everyone's body is made up of six things, water, protein, sugar, which is carbohydrates, vitamins, minerals, fatty acids, right? If I'm lacking any of those six things on any given day, I cannot be at my healthiest state. Um, therefore, my body's going to attack itself, go after its lean muscle and leave me not nutrient sufficient, right? So for me, I know my pro vitality is taking care of my vitamins, minerals, and fatty acids, but I'm still in charge of my water, protein, and sugar every day. And life can happen, right? There are things where sometimes I, I'm like, oh my gosh, I didn't have any water yet, you know? So, um, you know, being a mom and on the go and being an unpaid Uber, like that's what I call myself because <laughs> we are very busy with sports um, and I'm always on the go. Um, I like to have those vitamins and minerals, Pro Vitality is taking care of that. And then for me, the second product that's very important for my personal health um, something I like to call a little insurance policy, just in case I don't have enough water, protein, or sugar um, in the day is biotone. Um, I love amino acids. Amino acids go in, preserve lean muscle, help strip fat, promote muscle tone, and basically help me stay nutrient sufficient just in case I don't have those three things. Um, and then lastly, uh, my like non-negotiable foundational product every day would be the Neo Life Shake. And I drink two of those a day. Um, and absolutely love it. And let me tell you, you know, for my macro breakdown that I set for my personal goals, it is a lot easier to drink 18 grams of protein than it is to eat it. Um, and it's, it makes it a lot easier when it tastes amazing. Um, and I'm lactose intolerant and my, I can drink two of those a day and I am completely fine. Um, I absolutely love it. And it's nice to have high quality protein in your daily diet, right? And knowing that it's not going to spike my blood sugar level is so important. Um, so those three products every day, non-negotiable. Um, and then I have other products that I'm like intertwining, 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 <laughs> whatever that word is. Um, throughout my day, I just got the fiber for the first time on my last order. I'm obsessed. It is so good. Like it's, it's probably going to be my next every day. Um, but I do have super C in the cabinet. I do have vitamin D. I take those, um, you know, throughout the year at different States, uh, you know, different times of the year. Um, and then, um, the probiotic. Yeah. It's pretty uh, much, isn't it? yes. Yes. Yeah. But that's not in my cabinet. That is in the refrigerator. <laughs> yeah. Yes, exactly. <laughs> um, so, uh, have you been yeah. able to venture into the, uh, golden home care and the nutrients? Oh my gosh. Yeah. I didn't even talk about that. 
let me tell you how much money I'm saving on my shampoo and conditioner. Like, whew. and I, I love it. It smells amazing. My hair feels great. Um, and we just got the, the cleaning uh, Super 10. Yes, we just yes. got that in and that smells amazing. And it does a great job. And that's going to save us money. So I'm, I'm all about saving money too. So it's nice when you got good, good products and then you can save the money. So that's yeah. Cool. And then a nutrient or a skincare line that's organic. Under. Yeah, so my daughter is taking, uh, she has, is on that line right now yeah. and she loves it, loves it, loves it. Yeah. yeah. High school or freshman, you know, it's so important to have good skin and yeah, she's, she's doing that in the salmon oil. She loves it. Yeah. My daughters, they love it too. They've got, yeah. in fact, every now and then I uh, recently, I noticed I was missing a couple of, uh, <laughs> a, a bottle on my, yeah. my toner. I'm like, what? Yeah. <laughs> Yep. I they found out they had come and confiscated it. I'm like, go down to the to the supply cabinet. We've got more. <laughs> right. Yep. Um, that's awesome. Well, from a um, from a, a ten thousand foot view, how would you say? And you kind of already touched on this, but how would you say the products compare to what you've seen out there um, so far? And as a trainer, I know you're exposed to a lot as well. Oh yeah. And you know, if you and I think you already touched on this, but um, just kind of quickly mentioned it, but I know you were sharing with me that if you hadn't gone through what you went through, um, even if you hadn't had the rug pulled out from underneath your, your, your feet like that, which obviously that never, that never leaves a good impression, <laughs> but yeah. had that not happened and you were looking at Neolife versus Advocare or some of these other companies that we don't have to get into, but what have you, what have you noticed and what would you share with those who maybe like me, who've been on these products since I was 13 and didn't have a choice. <laughs> right, right. Now, since then I've seen what's out there and I know how blessed I am, but, but tell us. Yeah. So for me, like health's a feeling, right? So if, if you were to stop right now and you close your eyes and you don't feel pain and you don't feel sluggish and you don't feel bloated and, and you don't feel super tired, you just feel really, really good. Like to me, that's what we're striving for. And health does not have an end date on it, right? We're always going to be striving to be the healthiest versions of myself, of ourselves. Mm -hmm. um, so how do the products compare that I have decided to, to try in my life? Um, I can tell you this, I, I literally, I'm the strongest I've ever been. I have never in my life been able to lift as heavy as I am right now. Um, I just did a 215 pound deadlift. That's crazy. That's a little over time and a half of my body weight. I, this is mind blowing. Um, brain fog is gone. Like I feel like I'm on top of my game. Um, I feel my energy is amazing and I don't have to lean on the Neo Life tea every single day to get that going. I use that um, as, you know, I'm just looking for a boost. Um, so my energy levels on my foundational products, like I feel really amazing. And if I were to have, if I would have known about Neolife back when I had that original decision of all these products sitting on my table and which one am I going to choose? Yeah. I hands down would have chosen Neolife back then, regardless if that rug never got pulled out from underneath my feet. Mm -hmm. And it's because I've never seen a company that has the science behind it, the clinical proof behind it, and how clean these products are. Um, I think that people are moving towards figuring out that they need to start paying attention to what they put in their body. Because when you put good things in your body, good things are going to happen. And supplementation is just one key part, right? You also got to be eating good and sleeping good and good water intake, good sleep, you know, yeah. wrapped around consistency and um, don't forget to exercise, right? <laughs> um, but I definitely, um, I'm blown away with the integrity behind the full circle of your company. And uh, I've never in my life felt as good as I do now. I, true. Like, yeah. I just, I'm very great. I wish I would have known about it like a long, long time ago. Right. Um, but hey, we're here now. And you got to be grateful for what you go through to get where you're at. Yeah. And all things happen for a reason. And uh, yeah. I hope that answered your question. Yes, it did. <laughs> yeah, thank you for sharing that. And I loved how the other day when we were talking, you you shared how you love the facts and the tools, oh and, the, yes. and, the, and that kind of gets to the next question. Like, what are you doing to build your business? And uh, maybe you could touch on how you've also. I mean, it got me all excited again just hearing you talk about how 
you know, Josh, you know, the vitamin C and the, and how the products yes. compare and it's just good, fast facts that really differentiate yep. us in the marketplace. We touch on that and then how you're oh, building. Sure. It's, it's simple. It is very simple. Like when you're excited about what you have your hands on and you're walking in 100% belief in what you're doing, it is easy to talk about it because Neo Life isn't something that I just do. It's a part of who I am now. Mm -hmm. um, and I, it feels good to feel like I have found my passion here and I have found my home because it is, it's easy to talk about what these products can do. People, people don't care how much you know until they know how much you care, right? So when it comes to, if you're in a conversation with someone, I have found if you're talking to them long enough, they're going to tell you how meal life can fit into their life. And I'm very intentional about having that intentional excitement about what I am doing. Um, I keep a, a, a packet of Neo Life uh, Pro Vitality in my purse, not for me, because um, I, don't, I don't need it on the go. I, I keep it there for conversation. If we get into a good conversation with someone, it is so simple to just show them what I am doing um, and sharing uh, not only my results on how I'm feeling, but you know, those that I care about and those that, you know, I had the honor to coach and how they're feeling. Um, so it's definitely been an easy, an easy thing to talk about because I'm excited about it because it's, it's nice to just have that pure, authentic excitement about what you're doing. And, um, that app, I love the app because it is just, I don't know who doesn't watch that breakfast video in its entirety of the five minutes that it is and doesn't say, yep, I need that in my life. That's the missing key. That's what I want to do. Like, if you truly watch that, like the products is what makes this whole opportunity work is because the products work. And the clinical proof behind them is easy. Like I was telling you with the oranges, like this one little vitamin super C is equal to eight oranges. And vitamin, like it's crazy without the sugar. Like why, yeah. why isn't everyone doing that? Yeah. So it's just, it's those little things I appreciate that you guys do that it's not a smoke and mirror clinical proof. It is clinical proof, not on this ingredient does this, it's this actual product does this. And that's what holds the weight on what you can run with. So that, that's what makes this whole thing simple. You guys make it simple. Well, and, but you know what? It can be simple and have the tools. I love your enthusiasm and excitement by the app and the videos, but if somebody doesn't step out and share it, Oh, right. And then it wouldn't happen. So thank you for going out there and sharing and congrats on your um, executive manager, just about to hit director. Um, so what is, what is your vision for the future of your Neolife business? Where do you see this thing going? Ooh, big vision, right? Um, all I need to know is that it's been done before. Yeah. I know that with the Neolife opportunity, the Neolife products, my belief, my passion, my heart, how I lead, what I know I'm called to do and having that paired with a company and the incredible leadership that we get to lock arms with, the, the sky's the limit here. It's, it's just all about me putting uh, that heartbeat and that work and practice and being intentional about interrupting people's lives on what I know can make a huge impact on theirs. Um, you know, like I told you before in my life, I know I'm not called here to leave an impression. Like I want to make an impact because I know looking back at who I was when I was trying to figure it out, I remember going through what I did and waking up with that defeating thought of, Am I ever going to be that healthy mom that my kids deserve? Am I always going to be sitting on the sidelines or am I going to be able to reach these results? Like, I understand what that was like. And I know that a lot of people are trying to find solutions. Mm -hmm. And when you're hanging on to something that is the solution, all you got to do is go out there and be like, here, yeah. I got you. Right. Yeah. So, um, big vision. Bigger than I ever thought with Advocare, which is crazy to even say, um, you know, we were top 1% in that company. 
and now looking at having this opportunity, like, yeah, I'm excited. It's going to be really good. It really is. So um, world team, here we come. That's awesome. Yes, we're excited <laughs> to have you. Um, I'd love to have you in Grand Cayman Islands yeah. um, this fall. Um, now, let me, um, you know, just another thought. I remember you were sharing with me about um, Alan and Nicole being patient with the process. Oh my goodness. And what would you, what's that? They're incredible. They yeah. Yeah. Well, I agree with you. And what would you say to somebody who's listening about, you know, we all know people who could be great at this business, right? And we just, they don't, maybe they don't know what they don't know yet. And it's going right. you know, to take a little time to get there. What would you say to people about, you know, that you, you were speaking to me about the diligence that they had in following up, but yet also loving you right where you're at? Yeah. Um, could you touch on that? Because I think some of the times we, we either... We kind of give up on people because it doesn't happen as soon as we, you know, we think, oh, they're not interested or it's not going to happen right. versus just being cool with, you know, as you shared with me, you know, building yeah. that relationship and what, not giving sure. up, but what would you say? So for, for me on an outsider's perspective on how Alan and Nicole are, they're about you 100%. And as a servant leader, that's how you have to be. Yeah. Right. The second you turn that flip and you make it about yourself, mm -hmm. then you're not in it for the right reasons. Right. Yep. Um, so everyone's going to have a yes date and everyone's going to have a start date. Um, and they might not ever have both. Right. It's just it's about um, loving people where they're at, but being bold about what you have your hands on. Mm -hmm. You know, I've always been the type of leader that is like, I don't need you to say yes to me. I need you to say yes for you. Yeah. And if you're not um, big on, if you're not bold in your belief, then people aren't going to catch it. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So they could have, you know, when I, when I reached out to them originally, and then I took my time to kind of see, is this the right move for us? And let me, let me step back and, and look at everything. And, and I think I did that mainly because of the transition and everything that we walk through, right? So for me, it had to be, I had to be sure. Yeah. And uh, I took you longer than I- once. Yeah, and I took longer than I probably should have. I knew a lot sooner yeah. than I actually uh, decided to just close the book and jump all in. Um, but yeah, it's just, they they could have just blocked me off and, and not reached out every now and then. And they didn't make it about me in life. Mm -hmm. They, they were excited, um, you know, just watching my family on Facebook and, yeah. you know, lifting us up with that. I mean, they, they sprinkled in new life every now, Hey, we got this, you know, uh, retreat, you know, if you want to listen in, it might, you know, help you with what, you know, your decision is if you do decide new life's for you, or if not, maybe you'll catch something that can help you with what you are passionate about in a different company. So they, they made it about me. And I'm very grateful for that because it allowed me to have a, um, an opportunity to sift through and, and, and kind of jump all in when I knew was a good time to do so. So yeah, you got to love people where they're at, but you got to also be firm and strong in what you have your hands on. Um, and don't be afraid to reach back out because, you know, people don't know what they don't know and what they don't know can hurt them. You know, like yeah. I'd still be running around with brain fog if I didn't, you know, take the time to research for myself and not everyone's going to do that. Yeah. You know, so you, you got to stand firm in uh, what you have your hands on can change someone's life. And you're not, you're not, um, what's the word? You can't look at it like you're bugging them. Right. You got to look at it as what if what you have your hands on can change the rest of their life product or product with financial opportunity. You know what I mean? So yeah. it's just it's all about just painting that vision forward, being excited and being having that belief, but making it about the other person. When you have the heartbeat to do that, I, I think people pick up on that. People that see you and talk to you versus talking through you. If, yeah. So, yeah. Oh, I'm so glad that uh, mm -hmm. you shared all that with us there. That was a great way to end it. And I think really provides a lot of encouragement 
for myself and for all of us um, just to keep, you know, to keep the faith and not give up, love people for who they are. And I love what you said, the balance is beautiful, but it's yet still being confident in what you have and, right. and uh, willing to share it. And, and I love what you said too. You, you, you don't want to leave people where they're at, maybe in brain fog one way or another, <laughs> literally right. or figuratively. Right, right. So, uh, thanks. Well, thank you, Jamie. And we are excited about seeing you guys at convention. Oh, I can't wait. I mean, yes. You and Matt. I've never been to California. What's that? <laughs> I said I've never been to California. Oh, really? I can oh, remember. That'll, that'll be a fun experience. <laughs> My parents took me when I was very little, um, I think four years old. I don't yeah. remember. <laughs> so yeah. it's going to be fun. Uh, Matt and I are very excited about coming um, and getting to meet everyone and, and really taking a, a dive into the company as a whole and getting that heartbeat of everything and sit in the fire. So it's going to be good. I'm very pumped. I love what you said from your experience, how important convention is. Oh, that's so important. That's, you wouldn't have had been in the 1% and had the, in the other company and had the success you had without events. And so mm -hmm. you come into this knowing how important it is. Yep. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's vital. You know, we had a decision on, at that point, very, our very first uh, convention ever that we ever went to, um, we had a decision to either go or not go. And we were unsure about it. You know, it was like, Ugh, like, is it just big, a big rah-rah rally or like, could this be something? And I sat and I just looked at Matt and I was like, well, here's what I do know. If we don't go, we will never know how big this could be. Yeah. And at the end of the day, like if it was nothing, at least we got an amazing uh, trip out of it. You know what I mean? So right. it was, I'm grateful that we decided to jump into that. We've walked through the growth that we did and the pain because mm -hmm. I'm very excited to be home here with Neo Life because I, I don't know if I would have ever found you as early as I had, and I should have found you a long time ago, you know? So it's just, I'm, I'm very excited to come to convention and, and be a part of that. So when that side of med board is up there, I'm the, right there with the notebook. That's, that's my heart right there. So um, it's going to be a lot of fun. Awesome. Well, thank you for that encouragement to everyone who's listening, whether you're brand new or whether you've been in the business a while. Be at convention, like Jamie said, is an investment in you and it'll pay off and uh, you'll, you'll make a new friend when you get there and you meet Jamie. Well, thank you so much, Jamie, and say hello to Matt and we'll see you soon. Appreciate you. Have a good day. Thank you. Bye. Bye. All right. Awesome. So I hope you all enjoyed that. And um, I, I sure did. Just listening to that. It's just such a great reminder. I can't wait for everyone to get to meet Jamie and Matt at convention and for them to get to meet you all. But as I was listening to that, I was just um, just reminded of how grateful we, you know, I am and what a huge blessing we all have to have such an amazing company that I can confidently say 21 years later um, would not do that to us, you know, and and Advocare is not the only company that's ever done something done wrong by the distributors that built the company. And Anyway, it just makes me so thankful, so thankful for what we all have. And it's so easy, like any good thing that we get used to, to just take it for granted. Um, but it's fun to get to hear an, another person's perspective that, and I've never built a business with another company, so I wouldn't know, you know, but I know what we have is awesome and, and what a great reminder. Okay, I got to get out of here, but I've got to tell you something really, really important before I do. Um, I'm going to We've got a showing here at our house. Our house hit the market today. I got to get out of here in 10 minutes. So um, I want to share something real quick with you about convention. And then if someone has any uh, quick closing comment, I uh, would love to hear it. Okay. So if anybody hasn't heard, last I knew a couple days ago, there was only 18 tickets left for convention before it sells out. So if you know anybody that is not registered yet, that wants to get to wants to attend the biggest, most amazing event of the year, maybe the most amazing event of Neo Life's history. Get on that. They also extended the $199 special price that was supposed to end May 31st. They extended it. So those last few tickets are still the $199 price. So you need to know that. Okay. And lastly, the wellness expo that will happen on Thursday night. July, whatever that is, 22nd, 23rd, whatever that July, uh, Thursday is of convention, the evening that convention starts, is going to be streamed live. So 
Obviously, we want to get people there. It makes a big difference. You heard Jamie speak to that. They came out of convention, their first convention at, in Advocare, by the way. I don't think this was said. They were a customer for six months before somebody told them about the business. They did not even know there was a business opportunity until six months of using the products. Are we letting our customers go six months before they at least know there's a business opportunity? Something to think about. The Once they learned there was a business opportunity, they went to convention, they came out of convention so excited that they made what would essentially be director in Advocare in 30 days in their first month, okay? That's the, that's the difference convention can make for you and your team. So we don't want you to miss out on it. But if you have to miss out on it or someone else has to miss out on it, now online at neolifeconvention.com, you can buy online tickets. They can buy online virtual tickets. Okay, those are for sale as well. Unlimited supply, obviously, of online, online virtual tickets. But if you want to get your team there in person, there's only a few left. $199 is still the special price. Uh, until they're sold out and it will sell out. So I want to make everyone aware of that. Thursday night though, the Wellness Expo, that will be streamed live as well. And I believe maybe even free. So I don't know if there's a different link for that. So you want to make sure all of your club members and everybody know, even if they're not coming to convention about Thursday night's uh, Wellness Expo. It's going to be amazing from what I understand. With medical professionals, it's going to be done differently than has ever been done before. So Excited about that. Anyone have a closing comment before we shut this call down? Can't wait to see you all at convention next month. Going once, going twice. Have an awesome weekend, everybody. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next week. Bye.